Hey everybody, Scott Carson here with your note term of the day. Today's term of the day is AOM. Now, what does that stand for in the note business? Well, an AOM stands for assignment of mortgage. Now, in the note business, when I buy a note, uh, the property ownership does not change. The lender does, right? So unlike buying a piece of property where there's a deed file that shows the transfer of the owner from John Smith to Stephen Holmes as property owner, we don't have that. When I buy a note, the property owner stays the name, stays the same name, but we've got to show something that transfers ownership of that note. And that's what an assignment of mortgage is. It shows that one bank has sold the mortgage or transferred the note to somebody else. And for every time that the note has been sold, there should be an assignment of mortgage that corresponds to reflect that. So if Chase originated a note, and they sold it to Wells Fargo. There's be an assignment of mortgage gets filed showing the, the transfer date from you know, Chase to Wells Fargo. If Wells Fargo then sells it to Watermark, there should be an assignment from Wells Fargo to Watermark. And then if Watermark's selling it to me, there should be an, an assignment of mortgage from Watermark to me once I fund. This gets filed at the county clerk. This is how the bank is notified if taxes aren't paid or if there's a, a foreclosure pending on the property uh, from a second lien holder or something like that. That's a very important thing to get these things recorded. Now, sometimes you'll see when they're not recorded, specifically as the fund is buying portfolios and then shopping up a portfolio of notes, they may have uh, an assignment of mortgage ready to file for the new uh, note buyer. And then in that case, if you're the new note buyer, you may be having to get two assignments recorded. Uh, an assignment of mortgage is very essential in your loan, uh, your collateral file in your loan docs. Make sure, like I said, you've got to have one in there. An assignment of mortgage, if there is a missing assignment, I will not fund on a deal. It should be provided. Uh, you're not going to get the collateral, the hard collateral file, but a soft copy showing it being notarized in the date that corresponds with the previous note sale. So assignment of mortgage is one of the most important documents in your collateral file um, because it does, like I said, shows the transfer. If there is one missing, it's not difficult uh, to get replaced. It just takes a little while, and I will wait to fund on that specific note until that document is corrected um, to, my, to the, my, my attorney's happiness, I guess you could say, or the ability to be able to foreclose. Because anytime you go to foreclose on it, they're gonna, the attorneys are gonna ask for you to provide copies of the assignment showing the, the transfer that you uh, have the right to foreclose. Now, another thing, important thing, is if you're buying, uh, looking at notes and you see that some notes have been sold to uh, the tax foreclosure, have been lost to tax foreclosure. I still will buy some of those in case there's a tax overage out there, but you'll need to have a new assignment of mortgage showing that you're now the new owner of the note and have the right to collect upon that debt. So an assignment of mortgage, very needed. Uh, it is one of the most important documents in your loan collateral file, but don't flip out an AOM. Like what I said before, you need to have one for each transfer. If one is missing, ask for it to be shown, scanned. If it needs to be done, it can be corrected relatively easy. It may just take a little bit while to get the right proper signatures from the previous banks. Now, if there's a, a bank or institutions out of business, there's often other companies out there that can help you, either attorneys for that company uh, or other registered agents, and that's pretty easy to find by looking at the Secretary of State. But assignment of mortgage, that's what an AOM is in the note business.